We have lots of consensus depending on who we're talking to. And then there could be a lot of consensus, and then we'll talk to um, people that are part of the same country and who see it very differently, mm -hmm. and who see the opposite side as the same problem. Mm -hmm. And they see every solution as, as something that you know has perhaps left them out or discriminated against them. And I think we've, um, when you think about tech, you think about what you're saying about technology, this perverse thing that has happened, in my opinion, over the last couple of years, is that our, our technology has allowed our country almost to interact with each other in a way they never had before, um, because they're seeing somebody's opinion on Facebook or Twitter, and they're going at each other. And these are people that would never meet. They just live <laughs> in different places, different parts of the country, almost different cultures. People have described them as almost you know, different nations in the same country. They would never meet before, but here they are colliding. And it's becoming more and more unpleasant, more and more disruptive, um, more and more uncivil, and harder to get consensus for solutions. Because we're finding out that we're just, we're, you know, not arguing at the dinner table here in a good nature way. We're just feeling like we are on, on you know, looking at the world fundamentally differently.